Are we ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Okay, not to 100 kph was fast, not to 100, and 100 miles per hour, not so much. <laughs> and I think I completely killed the math for my mileage. Not that bad though. So I'm going to try sport mode, see if I can do the not to 100 miles per hour challenge. And for sport mode, I need to be stopped. So here it goes. Not really sure why this has clutch because it, it really isn't doing much. Now for spore, I press this while it's turned on for a while. It's blinking spore. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, this is different. Now it's got a lot more pepper. It's got a lot more pepper. <laughs> Holy cow! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now it's a different machine. Now it is a completely different machine. Okay, criticism, the gearbox is really hard. Really clunky. Now, changing modes has to be done with the bike stationary. Being able to do it with the bike moving would be awesome, so I could... For example, now there's no use in using sport. Makes absolutely no sense whatsoever, actually. I'm not sure if it's because I'm in second gear, but I can really hear her harvesting. Look, accelerate. And it's actually engine braking by quite a lot. So let's go. Wow, in sport, this is something else. <laughs> it's a rocket. <laughs> Wow, this is fast like this! If it was already nice to ride with in normal mode, sport is just opening the floodgates of power, or torque actually. Oh, come on. Let's see how fast this can overtake this guy here. Answer? Pretty f fast! <laughs> Suspension's really nice. Really nice. Feels really stable. Super light. And even with all this weight from the batteries, which I know has to weight a lot, doesn't feel heavy. feels lighter than my NC700X and feels... It feels like the CB500s, actually. It feels like a really fat 250. I'm not really sure if I'm more impressed by that. <laughs> wow. Corners beautifully, so yeah, it is a proper motorcycle. It's a proper machine for weekend fun. Look. Now let's try the bump here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. Stiff, but not painful. Good suspension, good brakes, good engine and electrical power. What more could you possibly want? Look at this! Look at this! Time to break! Wow! Suspension's a bit stiffer than I would like, but this is more sporty than you'd actually expect. Range 18 <laughs> it's it's nuts. Range is not 18 kilometers. 
So this range thing is a bit too sensitive to be actually very useful. Now it says 193 kilometers. That could be seriously improved. Like take the average from the last three or four minutes, not the instant. So suspension is a bit stiffer than I would like, being that it's tuned for performance. But since the seat is nice, it's not actually uncomfortable. You do feel like you're inside of a blender though, but it's not actually hurting your body. But you're always going... <laughs> it's just shaking your insides more than, <laughs> than anything else. Says who this sound isn't nice. It sounds like a speeder. It really does. Ooh, water. The bane of any motorcycle and sands. What the fudge are these guys doing here? Are you trying to get people killed? Because that's how you get people killed. So, do you recognize the road? Oh yeah. I'm going to film it on the way back. So, yes, I test rode it down for the Portuguese channel, harvesting energy all the way. And I'm going to test ride it up for you guys. This is my test track, so to speak. And riding down, I can tell you this handles just like a normal motorcycle. And not only like a normal motorcycle, like a good motorcycle. So now, going up, where I am more confident, never really understood why, but it's just the way it is, I'm going to see what this can do. I'm at 64% battery. Second gear. Full. Third. This was a bit harsh, this, this third gear. That was a bit too fast. <laughs> this can get scary fast. Oh, let's try leaning off the bike, see if it's natural. It is very natural. And if you want economy, you can just let her slow down because she harvests when it's slowing down. Whoa, that's... <laughs> This is some acceleration! Wow! <laughs> In sport mode, this is something else. And it's so... S it's smooth, but it's still very strong and constant. <laughs> Unlike other electrical vehicles, this is not a toy, this is a proper vehicle. It's a proper motorcycle, proper fun machine. Now, <laughs> this is about the part where I'd like a loud exhaust so they can hear I'm here. I'll just give them some space and then throttle up again. I want to do that last one. Oh yeah, this corners fantastically well. I'm not sure what my speeds were, but they were pretty high. And I was very confident on, on this one. The steering is very light, the whole bike feels exquisitely light, and then... You can rocket past anything! <laughs> and the lack of engine uh, engine growl under you only makes it seem like you look down and you're going, I'm going what fast? <laughs> it's awesome! And well, you guys might want a really good, a oh yeah, sand and water here. You guys might actually want a really loud exhaust and oh it's got no sound it's boring look it sounds wonderful 
I do hope you guys can hear this, but look. I love this sound. It's very sci-fi-ish. It's not dead silent like the Volta I tried, which was zero sound, no sound whatsoever. This one you've got the wind in your he in your ears, but over the wind you can still hear this whine. You can hear the chain. You can hear lots of things that you usually don't hear because the engine drowns out everything. It's great. I'm doing plus one kilowatts, plus five kilowatts, plus two kilowatts. I'm regenerating 2,000 watts. That's quite a lot. What if I'm in sixth? Am I regenerating anything? Nope. I have to be actively engine braking for this to regenerate. So this will be not to 100 miles per hour on a Bremo Impulse R in sport mode. Three, two, one, let's go. Not enough roads, this is a short road. But man, this goes fast. And this goes smooth at fast bends. Just look at the handling on this, I love it. There always has to be some traffic just to screw me over, seriously. This feels awesome. Really awesome. It's so stable. These tires are really good. <laughs> so yeah, this is quite usable. I'm not really sure how many kilometers I did, which is really stupid of me. I've done like, I don't know, 30 or something. I'll have to go into Google Maps, do my route and then see how many kilometers I did. Haha, <laughs> no feet. <laughs> we all play this game, don't we? <laughs> see? It makes a sound. Saw that guy looking at me, he heard the bike coming and he instantly knew it was not your regular day vehicle. So this is hearable. It's not loud, but it is hearable. Modes. So yeah, let's do a stoppy. 72 knots. 3, 2, 1, and stop. And I could have stopped a lot harder. <laughs> 